Well, good day, engineers, and welcome back to Train Sim 2015. Well, we're going to do some steam power locomotive stuff today. I found this one here. I actually haven't done it yet, so that's interesting. Um, World War II Part 1. Oh, there's a Part 2. Oh, I didn't even know that. Uh, so keeping the horseshoe curve, we're at the horseshoe curve right now. Horseshoe curve. Uh, keeping the horseshoe curve busy with traffic 24 hours a day, the urgent shipment of rations needed to be moved from South Fort to Johnson to be included consist, uh, consist due, to, due to be moved to New York docks tomorrow morning. With the power of two strong K4 locomotives, let's get started. Sorted, 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 sorry. Okay, so, sorted. Ooh, I don't like the sound of that, but anyways, let's fire it up here. Okay, so blah blah blah. I, mean, I think we just read all the transistor shipment tomorrow. Consignment between the handle you know, Okay, the consignment has been buried between the two other loads in South Yard Five. So you need to move the to you need to move the front consist and to South Fork Yard Two before collecting your train and getting your way. Uncle Sam is counting on you, driver. Okay. All right, so I have no idea what we got to do here first. Um, looks like I got a backup over that way. Let's just take a stroll over here. So fork yard two. Marshall. Marshall what? Hmm. Nine five five eight seven. Nine five five eight seven is our first number. Okay, what am I looking for here? I should have probably read my directions a little better. Hmm. I don't know why it wants me to back up in here. So basically, I gotta find nine five five eight seven. Oh, okay. So we're gonna have to back up into this one. I think it looks like it's. Already set for us that way. That one needs to go there though. Okay, so let's back up, let's back up and hook to that guy. Come on, baby. The old girls take a little bit longer to go, and you can't just jam the throttle and and go. Even the old style car, sweet dude, dude, whoa. I think there's some kind of bug with the cars. They're probably just going to drive right through. Yeah. Cheesy. <laughs> oh. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cars here that we've got to marshal. Nine, five, five, eight, seven, six, eight, eight. Two, oh, two, two, one, two, six, six, nine, oh, three, uh, three, sixty, five, zero, one, five. Okay, so those guys. Oh, okay, well, that makes sense. So we got to marshal them over to that other track, I suppose. I think that's our train in behind we need. Drop off. 
8.25 miles, that's not too bad. Okay. We're not going too fast here, but we don't want to be hooking on to the other guys either. Of course, stop too short. Okay, so now we need to marshal to this track. Now we just gotta double check our tracks here. We want to go that way, and no, that was right, and that way. Okay, I guess we'll pull them ahead. a minute for the brakes to depressurize here. Okay, it should be still make sure we want to go that way, that way, and that way, I think are good. So the only other one we are going to have to change, whoa, is that one right here whenever we get past it. Which is about right now, so that's not too bad. Okay, so that should get us right up to the one we want. Yes, it looks good. Okay, so put the reverser on, the brakes off. Get her backing up. Yeah, I like to put this little tab, oop, this little tab guy on here to see where I got to stop. But pretty much have to get the the cars in the siding, right? So and then we got to come forward and grab our cars, and then we can go. Some knob left these ones in our uh, in front here for us. So stop that I think now you have access to the loads that you need let's go and let's get her 
Okay, so we need to forward that. I don't usually go full tilt when I'm in here. Next minute for the brake pressure to come off. I guess that's actually pressurizing the brakes, releasing the brakes. When I put these on, it releases the pressure and applies the brakes. Okay, so we're going to have to go ahead to this switch here. Steamy. Yeah, we need a second switch over. So this one right here will switch and then back up. This guy, this guy, right here, right here, this one, this one. Full bore back up. I'll hook those up and then we should be good to go. It's quite a train. The back of boxed in at blah blah blah. I have lights. Um, sort of, kind of, I guess. Pennsylvania. You have your load. Let's get down to Johnstown. Okay. Release the brakes. Actually, let's see what happens if we put them on full. That should be zero, I think. Yeah, zero PSI. And release, she starts building pressure. So we don't have too far of a run here. 7.64, it's not too bad. These uh, steam ones are usually shorter missions. Okay, brakes are leased. And off we go. Sure was a way to have to to do things on these, you know, and the brakes here and wow. Once we get her out of the main line here, we'll juice her. that we're going to be crossing, even though they'll still cross right in through us. And the little uh, door here, that's like stuffing your coal back in. If you don't do that, and it gets down too low, it says, engine something went out. <laughs> Uh, 
Hopefully this is going to take us the right way. Oh, that guy's dead. Yeah, we're going the right way. That's good. And... Yeah, we've got a 35 kilometer speed limit coming up, so that's good. And we can juice her. Oh, we're speeding. Look at the speed we just gained there. Holy cow. That was sick. Two engines. That is awesome. Yeah, I know I'm speeding. shouldn't be going too fast here because we do have a, a switch or two to go through here yet. But our speed limit is 35 now. Woo we get at her. Holy cow, I guess we're going through all the switches here. Man, oh man, right to the one side or the other. It's quite a squiggly snake coming through there now. It's actually downhill. 0.4% grade too, so... Pretty neat. Oh, it comes another guy. He's got three engines. One, two, three. Holy, oh, that's cool. I was gonna say it's pretty neat. You can uh, mess with your reverser and stuff here, and uh, your throttle, and uh, you can either start losing speed or put it up and start gaining a whole bunch of speed or. Perfect combination that you got to try to hit. Wow, we've got some water pumped in there now. 104%. I never seen that before. That's kind of cool. About six miles left. Not too bad for an old steamer. old scenery too. Ah, oh, they're so quiet. Quiet and somewhat clean. I guess there's a bit of pollution, but... Oh, a nice river down there. Uh, oh, we're still going downhill, though.
speeding. Yes, I am. Oh, we got a 0.8% downgrade now. Ooh. Better put some more coal in. Keep her stocked. Top up the water, too. She burns up a lot of water. That's good. We can do some coasting here for a bit now. Bells sound cool. So now we could. I don't know if you're actually supposed to do this in one of these trains. You could put some negative on. Probably actually wouldn't work in the real trains. Actually, it's getting on us more speed. Put the reverse at a reverse, and there we go. Now we're losing a bit. Instead, you probably should use your brakes. That's pretty decent speed, though. Now we're 100 and 106. We'll close those up again. Do a coast by here and see how quiet it is. No throttle on. Silent. Wow, how much we got to go now? We're getting there. Well, just a little over three and a half miles. It seems like my pressure here is awful low. I don't exactly know why. Blower, maybe? Not sure what that is either. Some kind of alert thingy. Not exactly sure what the blower does, but... It seems like we got very much boiler pressure here. Or pressure my brakes almost. Boiler pressure seems to be going up. We're not really using anything right now though, so. I don't know. Not exactly sure what the blower does, but must blow something. Uh, it's a little less than two and a half miles now. Okay, so we better start slowing her up a little bit too. We're quite a bit over a speed limit here. Not that I'm really caring too much about speed, but anyways, we better slow her up. That blower definitely seems to be doing something. We're 100 PSI now. Glad that we turn that off. It's still gaining some, but not quite as fast. 
coal, we're good for water. Ooh, now we got lots of pressure. Definitely gains more more uh, pressure faster. That's good for that. Keep her well stocked. Still got 14.2 tons of coal on board. Holy man! It probably wouldn't take long for them guys to burn through that stuff either. Good volume is for. Uh, well, I guess we better start slowing up here a bit more. I guess she's slowing. Because we are pretty much almost there. I don't know what pressure this would go to, and maybe it would just explode or something. That'd be kind of cool if we could get it to explode. All of a sudden, that just seems to really stop fast. Pour it to it. Full steam ahead, so they say. Fifteen here, so I better start laying off and oh, might coast a little bit down here. I don't know. Nope, we're gaining more. Half a mile. Boy, that pretty much killed her. Holy cow. Come on, baby. Keep her on going. What the heck? What's up with that? Think you're hitting enough brakes and you hit too much and it almost kills her, or you don't hit enough and you go sailing right on through. Unpredictable. Well, we got some good pressure now. 126, we're down to what, 80 something there? Hey, good thing we weren't trying to get up a hill, we might have been screwed. Oh crap, I hope we're gonna end up going the right way here. Well, looks like we're wanting that second track, it looks like it's already set for us. Nope, it's not set for us. Well, let's check. Oops, let's check this one. That one's set for us, but this one... Here was not set for us. Oops.
blow her off. Got 150 pounds now, that's pretty decent. Hopefully that ends up going on the right track for us. I think yellow is the turn and white is a straight through. Definitely makes a big difference when you get more uh, boiler pressure there, holy cow. Which definitely obviously makes sense. Alright, so it says drop off, it doesn't say uncouple, so I think all we have to do is stop here. And that should do her, hopefully. Turn that off. drop off. Maybe we do have to uncouple. There. Well done driver, you got the load in the yard in time. The load is due to be combined into a larger train for shipment to Altoona tomorrow morning. Alright, we did her. So let's go have a look at our crap here. <laughs> Target's complete. 48 to 48, that's good. Stop zero zero and here picked up zero and I didn't pick it in the app. I speeding eleven times. Oh well, and then thirteen kilometers drove over eight miles. Nice. Took us thirty one minutes and fifty six seconds. So that was pretty cool. But um, I guess that's probably it for today. We'll uh, do another uh, um, train sim Sunday next week and hopefully enjoyed her today. Steam's fun, but it's slow, <laughs> very slow. And um, yeah, that's all about I can say is it's slow. Anyways, thanks for watching Train Sim, and we'll catch you next week.